The Japanese crypto exchange Bitflyer has said it will pay close attention to any hard forks that may happen as a result of Ethereum's ETH transition from proof of work (PAL) to proof of stake (POS), and that fork tokens that continue to rely on PAL could be supported. Writing in a blog post published on Monday, Bitflyer did not clearly state whether any fork tokens will be supported, but said it will consider it depending on the situation. We will pay close attention to the value of FBAL tokens and requests from customers, and depending on the situation, W. The exchange added that it will need the approval of the Japanese Virtual Crypto Assets Exchange Association JASIA, before any new tokens can be handled. Earlier this month, the major exchange Binance said it will evaluate and consider support for any fourth TTH tokens, while FTX had said it will evaluate the distribution of any fourth tokens. If FTX decides to distribute fourth tokens, we will distribute the tokens after the project is completed, FTX added in its statement on the issue. Similar wording was also used in a statement from OKX and other major crypto exchanges. Earlier this month, the US-based crypto exchange Kraken opined in a report that there is no black and white answer to the PAL vs POS question. Instead, anyone thinking of using the blockchain network should develop a nuanced understanding of the two and their trade-offs to determine which option is better suited to their needs, the report said. Ethereum's merge, or transition from POW to POTS, is expected to happen around September 15. When more, private equity fund reportedly plans to buy majority stake in Japan major crypto exchange Bitflyer to pioneer blockchain-powered home rentals platform Bitflyer links Japanese. European platforms to boost Bitcoin liquidity Japanese exchange to become first licensed holding platform.